I've been struggling to find, uh, to be able to actually get the information on what wheels will fit over those brakes. So I picked these up, um, they were cheap, and I, I know these will fit over because they are steels. So these are just an eight by 15 steel wheel. And uh, these, these were some returns that I picked up really cheap. And I know these are gonna fit because they're, um, the way they are sort of in here, I think if these don't fit, nothing will over those brakes. So um, I do like these. My only concern is <laughs> how much they weigh. They're uh, extremely heavy but it means we can actually get all the brakes back on and um, I'll be able to uh, drive it once it's, once it's all back together. Um, but yeah, I'm not sure whether I'm gonna keep these on it or not, to be honest, we'll see. These are slightly different offset, these wheels. So I just knocked up some spacers so that they sit in the same place. And these, um, these aren't just heavy because they're steel wheels, um, you get sort of different grade of steel wheels, like you, you get your standard car steel wheels which are quite lightweight, and then you get commercial steel wheels which are uh, thicker again, and then these are, these are like 4x4 four four or something, um, they're extremely thick. But they fit over the brakes, so I've got all the brakes are all now bolted back on and um just need some tire valves. We can stick the tires on. But I do quite like the black wheels against the green. I think it looks good. I'm gonna do some more painting now.
All right, so that's all the paintwork on the car finished now. It's been a hell of a job. Um, obviously, we're doing everything twice and all the little sort of uh, things that have gone wrong with it through the process. I've actually ended up painting these wings twice as well and uh, still managed to get some paint runs the second time. Um, the first time I had loads of these little pinhole. It's not really going to focus, but like there's a little hole there that, that goes, look, goes right down to the primer. And um, for some reason, I had them all over the wings. Uh, I panel wiped them beforehand. I actually had the same issue on the boot lid, but what I did on the boot lid was just got a uh, little brush and just dotted um, some paint into the, into the little holes. But the actual finish I got on the wings is probably the best um, finish I've had straight out of the gun. There's literally like no, no orange peel in that at all. I have got paint runs and I've got them in exactly the same spot on both sides, literally. Um, so I just was having a bit of trouble with painting around these areas, like when you're doing a flat panel, when you're doing the flat part of it, it's really easy. But I should have just led, led these flat really so that they were, I was painting them sideways, which thinking back was obviously you know, I should have just uh, laid them flat and I would have been much less likely to get any paint runs then, but got the radiator in, windows in. This, uh, this front one should have a chrome trim that slots in here, which I don't have. It got, it just all broke up when I pulled it out. So this seal, and it's not quite pushing this seal up to the window because obviously there's a gap that's still for the um, chrome to sit in there so I'm going to see if I can get hold of a, a, an inner piece the same as the back one that's maybe a little bit bigger to to close that seal up properly because the back one has a chrome um, trim and the front one doesn't Got my lights in as well. The uh, glass on this side's almost faded clear from the sun. Um, but I kind of actually like the old, sort of old with the new. And same deal with the grill. I'm not going to paint the grill or anything. That grill is exactly as it came out of the uh, field. Uh, I'll give it a clean, but I don't want it to, uh, I quite like the look of the old grill in with the, with the rest of it. I think it gives it a bit of character. So yeah, overall I'm, um, I'm pretty happy with it. It's come out better than I thought it was gonna. Um, I ran out of paint obviously because I painted the whole thing. Uh, pretty much twice, so um, I had to get transfers to send me out another load of paint and um, <clears throat> and uh, materials, mask and tape and paper and everything to do the whole job twice. So, so thanks, uh, Gareth at Transfers for um, sorting out all the paint. He supplied all the paint and primers and everything for the car, and um, that's been a massive help. So if you are about to uh, paint, a, paint your project and you need any paint supplies, then uh, give them a call, they'll sort you out. You know, you know the ends in sight when you're putting the glass in. It's going to be it for this one, just watch him. See you on the next one.